factors affecting reaction rate. There are five factors affecting reaction rate which are concentration, pressure, particle size, temperature and catalyst. Concentration. The higher the concentration of reactant, the more particles of reactant are present. When more particles are present, more effective collision will occur, thus the reaction rate will increase. Pressure. Changing the pressure of the gas is similar to changing its concentration. If the gas pressure is increased by reducing the volume, the gas molecules are close together. It will be easier for the gas molecules to collide, so more effective collisions occur. Thus, the rate of reaction will increase. If pressure increases by reducing volume, the concentration of the reactant will increase. If the volume reduces by increasing the pressure, so the frequency of collision increases, the rate of reaction increases. Particle size. When the size of reacting particles is decreased, the total surface area exposed for reaction increases. This one big lump has lower reaction than several small lumps. If you can see, this is the area or surface area exposed and the same size of one big lump has the same size of the several small lump but it is divided into small pieces so if you can see the surface area exposed by small lumps are greater than the surface area exposed by one big lump so when the size of reacting particles is decreased the total surface area exposed for reaction increases more effective collisions will occur Thus, the reaction rate will increase. Temperature The effect of temperature on the reaction rate can be explained in terms of kinetic theory. The average kinetic energy is directly proportional to the temperature. When the temperature increases, the average kinetic energy of reactant molecules is also increased. More molecules with enough energy Enough means equal to or greater than the activation energy. More molecules with enough energy will collide. The frequency of effective collisions will increase. Thus, the rate of reaction will increase. This is the Maxwell-Boltzmann distribution curves. It shows the kinetic energy distributions for a reaction mixture at two different temperatures. This blue curve is for temperature 1 and the red curve is for temperature 2. Note that the red curve for temperature 2 is higher than temperature 1. This is the collision energy for the x-axis. If you can see, this line shows the activation energy particular energy this is activation energy at this activation energy after this activation energy you can see this area this area shaded area for the temperature 2 has greater fraction of collision than temperature 1 this red area it has greater fraction collision this is fraction collision on the y-axis the temperature 2 has greater fraction of collision. This is because higher temperature has more kinetic energy. Higher temperature has more kinetic energy, so the molecules which has more kinetic energy will collide more. So that's why the temperature 2 has greater fraction than temperature 1. This area for temperature 1 this is for temperature 2 it has greater fraction for temperature 2 because it has higher kinetic energy for this one it shows that number of molecules for the 
y-axis and kinetic energy for x-axis. So average kinetic energy at temperature 1 equal to E1. So here, the average kinetic energy for temperature 1, we take for this one. And then average kinetic energy at temperature 2, this curve temperature 2, the average kinetic energy is E2. Note that temperature 2 for this curve, temperature 2 is more than temperature 1. This temperature 2 is higher than temperature 1. The E2 is higher than E1. Here, E2 for temperature 2 is higher than E1 for temperature 1. Therefore, when T increase, the T2 higher than T1. So when T increase, average kinetic energy increase. Molecules will move faster, more collision occur and more effective collision, thus reaction rate increase. The shaded area under the curve represents the number of molecules with energy equal to or greater than activation energy. So here is when the number of molecules has energy equal to or greater than activation energy. And if you can see this shaded area of T2 is bigger than the shaded area of T1. Since the temperature 2 is greater than temperature 1, at temperature 2, molecules have kinetic energy equal or greater than activation energy is more compared to T1. How do you determine this statement? By looking at the area. If you look at the area, the shaded area for T2, here shaded area for T2 is bigger than the shaded area for T1. So it means number of molecules that have kinetic energy equal to or greater than activation energy is more in T2 than T1. Only collisions with energy greater than activation energy are able to react. So when the temperature increase, average kinetic energy of the molecules also increase number of molecules with energy equal to or greater than activation energy increase effective collision increase thus the rate of reaction will also increase final factor that affect the rate of reaction is catalyst a catalyst is a substance that increases the rate of a chemical reaction without itself being consumed. A catalyst provides an alternative pathway which has a lower activation energy compared to the one without catalyst. Adding catalyst would cause the number of reactant molecules having kinetic energy equal to or greater than activated energy will increase. More effective collisions will occur, thus the rate of reaction will increase. This is the energy profile diagram for the reaction without catalyst. This is energy profile diagram with catalyst. If you can see without catalyst, the activation energy is high, means more energy required, more energy required for this reactant to become activated complex with catalyst with catalyst here this is with catalyst from reactant potential energy up till here this is with catalyst so less activation energy required for the reactant to produce activated complex this is the combined diagram for with catalyst up till here and without catalyst up till here so less activation energy required for the one with catalyst